Question three, we're asked to find the volume of a prism. Now, this is the same formula, and actually, it's on page two. Here it is. The volume of any prism is the area of the cross-section, the bit that is continuous all the way through our three-dimensional prism, multiplied by the length. So, let's go back. So, it's the area of the cross-section times the length. Now, if you look at the shape, we're told it's a triangular prism, means the triangle is the cross-section. So, we just have to work out this. So, the area of a triangle is the base of the triangle, times the height of the triangle, halved. So, the base of the triangle is 3. The height of the triangle is 4. So 3 times 4 divided by 2 is 12 divided by 2, which is 6. Now remember, we're going to times it by the length of the prism, which we can see here is 20. So 6 times 20 is 120. Now, there's four marks, I've only got three. You'll see here, very sneakily, they haven't given you anything. They haven't said, write your units, they're trying to catch you out. It's very naughty, really. But this is three-dimensional, and everything's in centimetres, so the three represents cubed. We have three dimensions being multiplied together, that's why it's a three here.